everything you need to know about Roblox update 0.21. Guys, this update is called Mega Box. It, it has combined six updates into one. Age Box, Alliance Box, Clan Box, War Box, Plot Box, Music Box. Now, there has been an article that you guys can find in the Discord server. I don't have the link to it. But I will put it in the link in my bio, in the link of the description of this video. So, it talks about how the... First, let's appreciate this artwork over here. The really beautiful artwork. This makes the game look so much better. Honestly, I want to play it right now. I'm a mobile user, but I can't because the update hasn't came out on mobile yet. N nor iOS or Android. It has only came out on Steam. So it talks about how it has ages, like seasons, alliances, uh, new wars, like more details and stuff in the wars, clans, plans and plots, music, and all that stuff. Which is really good because um, music was really needed in the game. Overall, we have 550 changes and many may have been forgotten. That tells you how long they've been working on the update for and they have, may have forgotten. So the patch log over here talks about new age system, new bloodline, uh, new ages, new air systems. Talks about also small um, houses, maybe different structure and all that kind of stuff. New ages, new eras. Age of Dark, Age of Hope, Age of Sun. Like, I'm gonna guess that every 200 to 300 years in the game um, is gonna day cycle and night cycle as it talks about over here. The long night could last through 200 to 300 years. And it's also gonna cycle within like these uh, ages over here as it talks about Age of Moon and Age of Chaos, Age of Wonder, Era, Magic, all this. And I'm gonna also guess that new stuff is gonna be happening. I'm sorry guys that I don't have the gameplay. I would love to show you guys. But um, sorry, I really don't have any kind of source to play the game right now. Wish I did, but I don't. Yeah, so it talks about new powers and alliances. Shows you the different levels. N new war mechanics, which is really nice. And I'm gonna guess the more features that you guys can see. More colors for cultures. And all that small little detail and traits, light lamps, speed. You know, you can now go more slow, which I think you need to, they need to make the game more faster. I think more people would like it where they make the game really, really fast. But, um, but whatever that is. They also have more, um, what do you want to call it? Like mods and stuff in the game so now you can mods more but not on mobile guys wish we had that on mobile but we don't we all scroll slowly and also talk about what i think they should have done but uh not uh, not on the update obviously i think the update is perfect they should have released it early but i did make a video on how i said the update will be released on march 12 2023 and a lot of you guys said i was bsing because that was such a long time and it wouldn't take this long for them to release it but guys see they released it on march 12 2023 it is what it is but i think they should have released the update on all three of the pl platforms together they have such a big team they're running such a big game. They have like 30, 40 million users combined, I'm going to guess. Because alone on Android, they have 10 million plus users. Steam, they probably have a lot of... I would probably say at least 20 million users combined. And they avoid Android and um, pretty much mobile users. Because, you know, they have such a big fan base on mobile a lot of content creators like me including our con uh like mobile based and all these smaller content creators including me because guys you know i've been hyping up the game i've been hyping up my instagram account like i've been hyping up the update for such a long time and for them not to give me a chance or the other users to or even other not just me i would have been happy if other players have the beta at least 
to test and give them feedback. They should uh, interact with their community more, the content creators. They should in interact with them because we are the people that are like leading this community, like pretty much who are slowly trying to grow up this community and potentially become like bigger YouTubers of because my whole con my whole like content is based off world box and stuff. I wish they gave me a chance um to like at least interact with their community and maybe ask me for my opinion. I have a personal group chat for those little YouTubers. But it is what it is. I think they should have released the game on all three of the platforms at the same time because every look if some if a PC creator is gonna show off all the um, features and stuff and the mobile user is just gonna sit over there and watch all the hype is gonna die out for him guys let me know if you guys agree or disagree with that because you know as i'm watching all these people play the game i'm like dang i wish i could do that slowly when i gonna load into my game on mobile i'm gonna be like ah oh, i already know about this i already know about that i already know about this so that's that's my point right there but i wish they could have done something like that it is what it is i uh, really can't complain at least the update is out. Hopefully, um, I would probably say a day or two to probably roll out on mobile. But guys, yeah, let me know what you guys think of this update. Um, comment down below. Make sure you guys like and subscribe. Trying to get to 3,000 likes. Share the, share the video. Appreciate it. Thank you guys very much.